and uh, carry Necro. But what you gonna do? Um, Slain, but Asta is just having a perfect time. Today, though, we already saw a... Uh, a Bloodseeker with a perfect game didn't do much Dockers. Taking a ton of damage. Asta is gonna be very fast. He does have nine stick charges. Going for the next. And our first blood will be there. Asta gets it. They're even going for the Necro. Wanna do some damage. Probably won't be getting the kill. But they'll definitely apply some pressure. And Asta knows that he's gonna be healing back up to full in no time. Doesn't even use the magic stick charges in Necro. Dropping low. He does have the stick charges. Looks like he's gonna be surviving. But definitely not gonna be looking too healthy. Not a lot of region being brought by the Nyx Assassin. Just I have lost all my uh, faith in Carlo though. This girl, she can definitely punch and she does have a weapon. They do have a snowball trying to go for Gogo -Go, who doesn't have that much mana. Might need to just turn around and fight if he wants to survive. If he wants to assert any kind of dominance in the, this one, but not gonna be happening. Bok gets the kill and that's the second one for TNC in this game. Top lane, look at Asta, look at his aggression. He's going really deep. Oh, nice take usage, but it's still not gonna allow it to survive. It might not be looking pretty solid. And finally, there's gonna be a kill. Carlo goes in as well into the acid spray. That's a lot of damage he's gonna be taking, trying to fight Fonti. And with another unstable concussion going in, it's level two. It's gonna do a ton of damage. Carlo should be going down. He's actually trying to fight. Fight till the end. Oh, doesn't get the kill there. Doesn't get the hit. We'll be ready to fight. Meanwhile, bottom lane, Bok in a bit of trouble. The TP from Carlo. He does have the snowball. And Google Go will actually be going down. It's gonna be the tower getting the kill. And Fonti now pushed back as well. Two points in acid spray. He does have two points in the unstable concoction. Might throw it out right now. Bok is looking very very much dead from that one. No, he will survive. He didn't brew it for enough. And without the uh, the time passing, not a lot, but in the bottom lane, there's a TP from the Invoker and Fonte is looking very much dead. He'll get the concoction out, but he'll still be dead. That's the uh, Urn of Shadows filled up. Let's see if they want to go for Google Go. The Invoker said Shadows, so next rotation, he's going to be even more dangerous. Bloodseeker goes in. Dockers does have the spike air piece. Will be doing a ton of damage there. They're actually thinking about going in on him. Still has the stun, but Dockers is taking a ton of hits. Really needs to be careful about this one. Oh, there's the ulti from the Fury that destroys both of them. Maybe he gets one of those kills, but Nature go through, and now they're thinking about going for white and He destroys the Haster because he knew that he couldn't get to it in time. He just wanted the enemies. No OT pink bottom lane. They won't box dead they might be able to get it nice tp from dockers y chan has the ulti the stun does connect and bok will die even without the usage of the winter's curse in the end they decide to use it no reason to risk anything and y chan gets the kill but asta now is turning around with the warlock coming over dockers spike carapace will be fine but these two heroes they are stranded winter wyvern will be able to take up flight fairly soon he does go for the cold embrace carlo though has the uppercut punch the walrus punch is there they have the tag team as well they see him perfect in y chan will die now looking towards dockers looking dead as well Uses the spike carapace, but the beautiful blocks in the end they drop the golem this time around There's no winter's curse To turn my beast around and the alchemist not gonna be happy about it Why Chen doesn't have the ulti just yet, but we'll have it soon Mavis Where's your golem? Oh, yeah, you don't have it. Oh, the beautiful snowball save You're not gonna reaper sight anyone, but now both of them get stunned up and the solar garden is coming over The task will get stunned up as well. Carlo is looking very much dead turns around with the uh, walrus punch But it's still gonna be losing his life now. Let's see. It's gonna be Y Chen that is caught But he does have the winter's curse. So you have to run away right now Here comes Asta has to be very careful and the winter's curse is there gonna be taking a lot of damage from the creeps from this fury on Asta taking some damage but still fast enough to survive. The Winter Wyvern will survive himself. The drop charges won't be doing enough and they will just bail. TNC a very strong damage dealing hero though now he has stopped flying and Carlo just uses a perfect charge. Here comes Bok who has the science. Y Chen will not speak. This Winter Wyvern is pretty much dead but Krish he might die first so not getting any earned charges. That is a big deal. Bok in a little bit of trouble. Stranded right now needs to go for a TP out. Can he do it? The damage will be sufficient and Fonti gets it. He dies in the mid can easily die here that has no sentry is looking very much dead and asta being stunned up is there anyone to save him he slowed down as well why chen needs to get a hit and after that hit this blood seeker will most definitely die he gets the blood right, blood right off and the winter wyvern might be side baiting it out by dockers he'll get the impale off beautifully done everything was perfect for dockers and now carly will die gorilla are playing out of their mind meanwhile in the mid lane the golem gets dropped the upheaval is there but it's only level one no one who will get slowed by it too much. Dockers goes forward. He wants to stop that upheaval. But no, he's just gonna start digging graves. This isn't gonna be his own or the ones of TNC. The Winter's Curse is still ready. Bok is looking very much dead. How can he get out of this one alive? He cannot. He's gonna get 3 sight in the first one of the game. 
and still gonna be quite nice. Now the golem will still die. Curse, he has found the warlock. This warlock has been annoying to him. He went for the hand of Midas. Dockers might be in some trouble, but he's looking like he'll be fine for now. Does get the spike air pace off. The cold embrace is there, but not being used on the next assassin just yet. Dockers still surviving, and he gets the stun off. Where's the cold embrace? Save me, save me, my friend. Why Chen going for a TP out? The invoker coming over, but it's gonna be way too late. Um, Mavis. What are you doing there? They have the Yules. This is a very dead warlock. He will most definitely die. The question is how fast? These guys on the side of doesn't know where the ward is though. Meanwhile, mid lane Krish going forward. Y Chen gonna get silenced up. Can they save him? The answer is gonna be as the golem not connecting and Y Chen gets himself out. Now just turns around. Who has been ruptured? He's gonna be the necro with the sun strike. Gonna be taking some damage, but still alive. Bok here uh, is gonna get gone on. But still, look at this. Y Chen still alive. The snowball will not connect him. He takes up yet again will he die to the fatal bonds though he's telling to his teammates stop taking damage right now no one is dead just yet in this fight we need to see what's going on everyone is out but the NC they want to re-engage Carlo going forward he does have the snowball there it is Fonte needs to drop out his unstable concoction will be able to do it and Mavis is looking very much dead now the Reaper side is not going to be getting a kill but in the end Carlo will die either way only three heroes left alive on the side of TNC but they're all the cores Fonte goes forward they stun the invoker they can have another stun as well but the silence on the Alchemist will mean that he stuns himself. No, uses the BKB in the end. Won't be stunning anyone. So meanwhile, on the other part of the map, Y Chen has been ruptured. He's bleeding yet again. That's an only level one stun strike. Not really doing that much damage. They have the uppercut punch. He is dead. Now Bok in some trouble. Here comes the uh here comes the Dawnbreaker, but the next assassin will lose his life. Dockers needs to be very careful. Gonna have a stun in a sec. Attack him because he is smoked. Meanwhile, in the mid lane, here comes the meter. It's not gonna be doing that much damage, but the Necrofoss still gets put in a very uncomfortable position, and ultimately, his life will be taken away. TNC is starting to use the mobility of their heroes to get kills around the map for 35. Here oh, he gets bashed! Fonti might just actually go down right now! He has been uh, bashed by the Roche! What an unfortunate turn of events! This is perfect for TNC! Roche is on their side! They have a sixth man that they will kill! Right now you have done your job and now you're dying! Dockers goes inside, he uses the spike care phase. They haven't spotted him. The sentries have been devoured. The white is in a little bit of trouble. He's trying to fly away, but you will fly against the wind no more! The Winter Wyvern will fall and that Winter's Curse will not even land them again. Now they're looking towards Dockers as well. The Sun Strike will connect. Okay, he does get the hit there from the Vendetta getting the kill, but in the grand scheme of things, it will not matter because TSC destroy all of them. And now the Roche will be taken as well. Asta will have two lives. Roche, you have served your this is life. So let's see now if White can make anything happen. There's the Winter's Curse, but not surrounded by anyone. Carlo will still go down. Fonte is there. Secure the kill. Now Krish would like to get at least that BKB out of the Alchemist without the Winter's Curse. He can be as aggressive as he wants. White Chen takes self flight yet again. Krish will be taking a ton of damage. It's slowed down quite a lot as well, but White Chen will be able to fly away in time. TP out. Let's see if it's gonna be successful. He's not even attempting it. He's just staying there, waiting for his death. No, that's a little bit too late because Krish is around you. No, he actually doesn't have the spell to stop it that is a problem oh necro comes over bkb on the seeker it's there oh snowball save not gonna be coming out he tried to save the Aegis. not gonna be happening the rose shroud is there for the necro he's gonna try to keep himself alive gets the yules off he's gonna have the uh, death seeker as well so can have another astral but gets stunned up either way now the warlock is dead fonti goes for a tp out nothing to break that one the solar garden is there they bring their supports to die the cores have left their support stranded and the dawnbreaker is trying to live the celestial hammer will be there pushed into the cliff if you're gonna be the goat and now you die they bring him down again they're just playing with go go whatever they do well however they use their spells go go and had no chance of survival there beautifully done now bottom lane fonti no bkb needs to be very careful how he approaches this but he's actually gonna be fed himself stunned Still, Sun Strike onto the hill. They want to see if they're being under vision. They see Dockers. Uppercut is there. They have the snowball as well. They'll get the spike carry pace off, but a beautiful Winter's Curse. This should be Carlo going down. Let's see if he can get out of this one alive. No, they kill him, but still, the golem gets dropped. Necro, can he survive this? He still has the Yules. Nice disarm there. Go, go. Not going to be doing anything. Box still has the BKB with the AC. He's able to stand his ground and fight Fonte finally. Going for the Seeker, but the BKB, Asta can use it. Doesn't even want to. Can they break that TP? Yes, Fonte has been left alone. Alone in this 
this world, but it's better to die than live without friends. Asta knows it, and he makes sure that the Alchemist has a nice, clean, fast death gorilla. They don't think they can win this game any longer, and I think that they are right. They will call GG, and the uh, series will end 1-1. The top two teams on the standings after the group stages will go 1-1, so we don't...